guys so this is what i'm having for dinner some chicken southwest flautas the ones that you get from the box are actually pretty good and i paired it with a side salad and yeah that's what i'm having for dinner so i'm gonna have this as like a little snaggity snack they're loaded cauliflower bites bacon cheddar they are breaded rice cauliflower bites with cheddar cheese mozzarella cheese green onions and bacon I popped them in the air fryer and i paired it with some Devil Spit Barbecue Sauce from Famous Dave's. Y'all, low-key, these are really good. I was a little hesitant because not all cauliflower bites taste good, but these are really good. Definitely recommend 5 out of 5. I just finished washing my makeup brushes. Look at that. I'm embarrassed to say how long it's been since I've washed them, but the thing is I got it done also washed my beauty blenders and i'm putting them on an air fryer liner because these things come in handy for multiple uses you guys not just for the air fryer i'm just going to give this a rinse and y'all this is the cleanser that i use the style pro this is absolutely the best cleanser i have used to date when it comes to washing my brushes like definitely recommend i have a video on me reviewing this product I will link it down below and you guys now that I've washed my brushes I'm finally going to be using this juicy makeup bag that I have had for some time but I didn't want to use it until I washed my brushes but I finally got around to it so I can't wait to start using this bag I just love the pink and black look at that this is how I make my eyes coffee sometimes I buy the one from Starbucks that's already meant to be cold coffee but I actually just brew my coffee let it cool down for a bit and then I make it here I have my coffee that I brewed earlier in the Keurig get my creamer just like that and there you have it you guys this is a cheaper option if you're not buying the starbucks cold one so this is what i'm gonna have for lunch for brunch i haven't had no breakfast and it's like already three so it's like my brunch so i heated up some of the flautas from yesterday these are the southwest chicken flautas from del mex i think and they're so good and i paired it with some cheese but added some pico to make it like some chile con queso type of style and yeah that's what i'm gonna have and my coffee my cold coffee good morning you guys look at this weather i am living for it so these are the cookies that i picked up yesterday from albertson's i've never tried the peanut butter the hershey's peanut butter cup these are absolutely my favorite the almond joy i don't know i want to have a piece or two i'm not gonna eat the whole cookie i have my cold coffee right there that i just prepared i need to get ready it's like 11 40 and i need to be out of here by one because i got an appointment i gotta go to okay so i'm thinking about wearing these these dark denim shorts with this just a basic black tee and maybe these boots i just need to dust them off since i showed you the weather it's a bit gloomy and it is raining and I don't want to wear sandals because my feet are going to get wet. If I wear tennies, they're like knitted, so my feet will still get wet. So I'm just going to go with the safe side and still wear this, but with the boots. All right, you guys. So I really have to come to, I really have to go to the restroom. And I'm like, kind of like in my old stomping grounds where I went to college. And I want to see if I can use the restroom here. Here's my fit. Just a basic black tee, some shorts, and my, boot, my cute Prada dupes. I'm right here in the parking lot. And I swear it looks like all this view in front of me just gives me Jurassic Park vibes. Like all those trees and you get that yellow spot right there is McDonald's. So we just got to Rainbow Fountain. They totally remodeled it. The sign, they used to have like a carport. They did away with it. So now it's just like a parking lot. 
So this is what it looks like, but on top they used to have this like carport. Okay, so we're just waiting for our food. I got all the salsas, got some ketchup. I'm right here sitting next to the mirror. Just got my torta. This is the cebrada. Mm. This is a tejana bistec with chili and cheese so we're sharing this is the cebrada this is bistake and long green chilies i'm so hungry you guys I'm gonna ask for my salsa salsa the salsa here is so fire you guys get this bite mm. so we came to ross because what better place to walk off this food because I'm so full. So we're going to go here and then we're going to go to Marshall's. That's right next door. All right, you guys. So we just have Ross. I'll show you what I got when I get home. But we are now here at Marshall's. This is what I have bought at Ross. It's this water mister. I like the aesthetic of it. I like the way it looks. I had seen that at Ross for $3.99. They had a pink one, but... The pink one looked like it had water, like somebody had used it and returned it. So I opted for the blue one. This is dinner. On Wednesdays, they have the Whopper meals for $4.99. So I got one, but I'm sharing it because I'm not too hungry. But I did turn in my fries into some cheese fries. Came to get some air in my tires. That's what I love about Firestone is if you buy your tires here, you can always just come and have them fill air instead of having to go to a gas station paying to put air in your tires here. It's done by the professionals who know how to actually do it because I don't know how to even do it from one of those air pumps from the convenience stores. So that's what I love about Firestone. Okay, so I have bought some Nashville hot tenders the other day from Albertons. And these are the leftovers. So I'm going to make myself a salad with these. And these are not bad, you guys. They do have a kick to them. So yeah, definitely worth trying. Because it's breaded, I'm not gonna add like croutons or anything like that. Gotta make, I gotta balance it, you guys. So, so it's already got the the fried part in it, just like that. And of course, some of my favorite, Kent Steakhouse Light Creamy Caesar. I went to Sam's and I'm gonna show you what I found. So they had these Gap logo shorts for $5.81 and then they just had the Members Mark, which is the brand from Sam's. And these are these were marked down to 381, so I grabbed me a pair in this navy blue and the black one. But I already wore the black one. Um, but I like these type of shorts because they are just like for lounging. Um, and they're like like that terry cloth, like the French terry kind of cloth material. So they're not hot. They will make you sweat, especially like where I live. So. They're very comfortable. I definitely scored there at Sam's. Hey, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. Today is another day. Today is actually Friday. Um, I am low-key craving the hot dog that I had last week. And I'm craving that strawberry ice cream I had from Costco last week. But this time, I want to add Oreos on it. So, I'm thinking I'm going to have Costco for dinner today. Because it was so good. grab a coconut milk that way I can make myself a homemade piña colada and it's light there we go lady boba I've never seen these lady boba this looks interesting I'm gonna give this one a try this is the bougie root beer this one's kind of expensive but they have it at the Dollar Tree I'm gonna give this one a try Actually, I'm going to get two so I can try one and I can give the other one to my son. They have these candies here. And I saw this drink and they use these. I don't know which one to get. I'm going to try to make some kind of drink. I'm going to try these. 
No Oreos. Absolutely none. I went to Five Below and guess what? I found me some Oreos and there they were a dollar. If I had bought them at Dollar Tree, they'd be a dollar twenty-five, but they were literally one dollar there. So here are my Oreos, here's my ice cream. We just got out and it's already melting, so you have to hurry. Oh, I've been craving my ice cream like this for a week, you guys. Just gonna mix it in like this. So here is my ice cream. I put some crushed Oreo on top of the strawberry. I saw that they had this Jalisco Chamoy Michelada. I feel like I've tried most of the flavors, but I haven't tried this one, so I want to give this one a try. So let's try this one. Cheers. This is good. All right, you guys, I was in need of a new candle. The ones I had were from the Better Homes and Gardens because I had picked them up at Walmart on clearance. Um, and they took away the ones that I really like from Target. I don't know if they discontinued them or what, but they don't have them in stock anymore. They're like unavailable. Anyway, so I saw this one at Walmart yesterday and I picked it up. It's a bread lava and citrus. It was like 10 something, which I didn't want to spend $10 on a candle, but I do know for a fact that these do really um, work and they really do make the room smell very nice. We're back at Sam's because I got decaf and I needed regular coffee. So I'm going to return it. Mm -hmm. Alright you guys, another reason I wanted to come to Sam's is because I've been craving the sushi from here. Because they actually make really good sushi and I got this one. It's a Walton roll. This is 838. I'm going to try these roasted pork bao buns. Then I got this avocado one and then I got this one right here. The California crunch roll. So yeah, I'm excited. All right, you guys, and this is my card. So these are the sushis we are going to end up taking. Just some mac and cheese, some coffee, and then all this other stuff there. <laughs>